Last episode, in my Theme Park Tycoon 2 series, we built a basic money farm and made an extremely detailed entrance. This video, we will move further on into the park making some shops and stores for the main entry. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of my Theme Park Tycoon 2 series. Last episode, we built this entrance. It looks great, it's detailed. But now what we are going to do is be moving on with the rest of the park and we are going to build the main street slash entrance sort of area. Pretty much just a couple of shops themed the same as the park entry. My main idea is that I want three different paths which will eventually lead on to different lands. On the corners here I'm going to put little shops to give the effect of a town. Pretty much this is the basic idea I want to go for. The blue will be buildings and the paths will lead on to different areas. So let's get started with the first building. While I was building this, I was just too focused on it, I didn't narrate anything, so I'm going to narrate it now. Basically what I was going for was a similar theme to the entrance of the park. Using the tan bricks as the base of the building and the green and purple as like the highlights of the building. I decided to go with these Roman walls because they added some 3D texture to the building, making it less flat and making it look a lot better than what it was before. Not only that, it made my life so much easier as it did a lot of the detail for me. This is the first building done. I'm very happy with it, but I'm still not finished. I think I'm going to come back to it though, just to add a bit more detail. But before I do that, I'm just going to finish the rest of the buildings to get a base down of this village. With the second building, you guessed it, it's pretty much the exact same. But since I'm working with a bigger plot, I'm going to turn the one building into two smaller buildings just to add some more uniqueness to it, make it look more like a compact little village. So pretty much with these two buildings, I use the same type of Roman wards just to keep a consistency throughout the park, same kind of base colour but I just changed up just a little bit. On the top of this first building as well, I decided to add this little water tower because I thought that looked really cool, it adds some more depth and some more detail. Pretty much from there, I just finished up the roofs, I added the windows just to add that little bit more detail and then I was done with those two buildings. Now for this next building, I wanted to add like a point of interest to the town, so like a town hall kind of thing. So I decided to go with a bell tower. I think this looks great, like it adds just so much detail being the tallest building as well. It adds tons of depth to the village. At this point, I was so tired, I just wanted to sleep, but the grind never stops. The last two buildings before I could start to get into what I think is the fun part, which is like all the little details. So I quickly finished up these two buildings, pretty much the exact same as the other ones, just with different shapes. It's done, I'm just finishing up this last building, but so far I'm very happy with how this looks. Now we can get onto the fun thing, which is just detailing everything, putting stuff everywhere, making it look super cool. Now the first thing I'm going to do is put some of these like rope fences around just to add some more depth into the middle of the streets because it is quite plain because there's nothing there. Honestly, I think that looks really good. So now I'm just going to add a couple of like rocks around just to add some like imperfections to the place. I've only done a couple and it's already starting to look a lot better. Now one thing I'm going to do is just add some stuff into this little alleyway and make it look really cool. Add some planks here. Oh, a couple barrels would look good as well. Over here I'm going to add a couple barrels and some crates. Put this clay pot on top like this. As I'm adding detail, I need to talk about how I need your help. I have absolutely no clue what the first themed area in the park is going to be. It could be a TV show, a book, a movie, it could be anything, any generic idea, it could be Wild West, it could be Pirates of the Caribbean. Another thing I need help with is the actual name of the park. I still don't know what I want to call it, so leave your comments down below if you have any ideas for a theme or the name, and I'll reply to each comment, so let me know. And so far, that is the park. I have finished the second episode. I really love how it looks. The color scheme's awesome. I'll probably do more detailing off screen and do just minor things like that. But for now, I think this is looking good. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to see part three, it should be coming out very soon. So make sure to subscribe. See you in the next one.